what's going on everybody on youtube this is mk the truth the deal dbent i got another pair of the spider-man edge old ones for us to take a look at today if you guys are new to the channel go ahead and subscribe to my instagram where i will be uploading detailed photos of this particular shoe now first things first people my reviews are for educational purposes only but take a glimpse at the stuff see how good they still hitting on that's it and we get on up out of here i repeat educational purposes only so this is the older spider-man there is one that's coming out pretty soon Soon, that's pretty terrible in my opinion i kind of want to save my judgment until they come out but i just don't think i'm going to like those at all anyway you got the special box that was only given to uh i believe like uh i think it was like a promo sample it wasn't really given to that many people like the paper that you have on the inside it is a little bit thick i think it's supposed to be a little bit thinner than that and then we're gonna go ahead and get a look at this shoe so basically uh what i've seen when i took a look at these it looks like they're going backwards still on this particular shoe and what i mean by that is it's a good looking shoe and it's like a it's like a difference in materials the reason why i say it look like they're going backwards is because the upper on the spider-man this spider-man the miles morales uh you're supposed to have a red new buck not a red you're supposed to have like a red distressed new buck, not a red leather. If you look closely, you see you have a heavily tumbled red leather, and that's not how the shoe is supposed to be. Black wings logo up at the top. Nike swoosh looks pretty good. You got that sort of a Spider-Man graphic on the inside there. With the patent leather on the piping or the outside of the shoe or of the Nike swoosh. Sorry. The leathers are really good. I will say that the leathers feel well, they feel pretty good. They're nice and tumbled very heavily tumbled it's not supposed to be as heavily tumbled but it's not too bad like i said the material has a flip-flop you're supposed to have new buckle on the red and this is all pure leather um another thing the bottom is kind of turning already it's not too bad on the the translucence on the bottom but you do see some yellow already coming in here the shoe was probably sitting for a little bit toe box not too bad looks pretty good uh once again people these little dots here i know they were kind of transparent where you could barely see them but keep in mind over time how you store your shoe this will start to show up all over your shoe it's no escaping that it's like i don't know the exact material that they use to achieve this with the 3m in it but over time it will start to reveal itself anyway i love to hit a blue up at the top with the red contrast really well and i like the difference of the material too but i gotta call it what it is this is not the uh correct finish to the leather on the upper does come accompanied with a red pair i don't remember white could be a white pair in there as well but i the last pair that i had i put blue laces in it and i think blue against this red looks really good above all shape looks pretty good like i say you got a little bit of pre-aging down the bottom these may have been sitting at the bottom of the stack somewhere let's check out the other shoe right quick see what we hitting on look pretty good a little bit wavy we got a little bit wavy a little bit touch up ain't too this is what that's a that's a lot of it start from about right here Ooh, ooh we got a we got a big glob let me see if i can see that yeah it's a big glob right here all right nike swoosh this nike swoosh is a little bit weirdly shaped but like i said you know that these things happen see if we got that graphic on the inside up top we do we do we do we do i kind of like the leather i kind of like the leather but that's not how it's supposed to be yeah the nike swoosh is a little bit odd it's a little bit odd but it's not too bad anyway blue on the inside with the nike air pretty good pretty good you use this as a beat to cut up your grass or something cutting your grass or something uh maybe i'll do a comparison of how this should be uh opposed to this one this one's not bad i'm not mad at these i like the uh i do like the leather kind of it's not bad but it's supposed to be like a distressed new buck anyway this is the air jordan one spider-man like i said it's always good to go back see what they're hitting on what are you doing you still doing it right or not looks like they changed the material or this could be like an older pair that has been sitting for a while due to this yellowing down bottom anyway this didn't look like that in my qc so i couldn't really tell let me know what you guys think about these down below this is mk the truth d-o-d-b-e-n-t hey man i love y'all we out